welcome back to my YouTube channel. It feels really weird because I've done the part but I'm doing my intro now but hello and welcome if you are new here. Hello I am Bethan. Please subscribe to my channel. I will love you and if you aren't new here thank you for subscribing. It honestly means the world to me. You will have a special place in my heart. So yes I am as you can see just doing a quick little tutorial of this little Dutch plait here. Uh, yeah having a bit of gossip with you so on so please keep on watching and at the end I will be announcing the details of how to enter the giveaway so yes to me videoing me doing the hair okay so the first thing please excuse the mess of my hair I was going to wash it and then I thought you know what when you wash your hair and it's just been washing it's all like and it doesn't sit right so I thought I'll just leave it while it's knees washing and it's a bit like a line for me the first thing you're gonna want to do is grab a brush, brush, a brush, and just I'll brush all this out. This is just my hair just coming out of a a bun. Give it a good brush. Oh, you can see probably all the stuff flying off my hair, like dry shampoo, and you know all that jazz. Sorry if I keep looking over there, obviously there's a mirror there. I was going to sit you like, you know, with my little imp inspirational board behind me, but I thought, you know what, what's the point? I can stand up, watch, I feel like this isn't even going to work now because I'm videoing myself. You know when you like put your hair in a bonnet at night when you don't want it to go nice, it's like, oh my gosh, it's so nice. And then when you try and do the bonnet, it's like, Oh, really? So yeah, I feel like that's going to happen today, but we'll give it again. So I usually just brush everything to the side. I don't really worry too much about this bit because you can do something with this, but I feel like if it's right over, it's going to look a bit... So yeah, so we're just... She can get a bit more... And then you get three just small pieces. And she can see like that. And then you just start grabbing, adding, oh sorry, I thought my cat was being sick there. Adding bits on to each section, if that makes sense. So like, oh, hold on there. Adding on, adding on underneath gonna look a bit weird first and then scraping adding on it just get tricky to figure out because obviously you can't see your bits and you don't want them all tangled together adding on <laughs> adding on Adding on, <laughs> and this is where you really need to start getting all your bits of hair in at the back. So just to make sure that all that's brushed. So adding on, and then when you've done anyway, you can like I will show you because I don't think I'm going to make this sound very correct. But you can just. Like pull it out so it looks baggy. You don't have to have it literally like stuck to your face like it looks like right now. And then you just keep adding on. Not that I can see neighbours, it's really all people are gonna be able to see right in my house and be like, who is she talking to? It's like my YouTube friends. Adding on. Oh the cluster is alright. Adding on and then you'll start to see and you get the last obviously because it's going all your hair in and then you just come down into a plait like so and some people like stop there and just have all like this jazzing about but I'm just gonna go down a little bit like so I'm just deciding when to bloody and stop stop there yeah, we'll keep going. 
You look so funny. Hello. And then I'm just going to go all the way to the bottom. Now you might want to use like a really thin bottle of bobble, but I'm not, I can't see any thin ones to hand right now. So I'm just going to use my little white one just to tie it together. Sorry, one second, I'm just get closer so I can see what I'm doing. So then you're just gonna start like pulling the little empty bits out. Cause it sounds like it's a towel then, doesn't it? <laughs> like this. And then I'm gonna keep 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 going. Oh I'm making it look really messy, aren't I? I'm literally just, I don't want to ruin it, so I'm just trying to concentrate on my bills. I can bring out that. <laughs> I'm going to get my, oh, this is exciting actually. I'm actually going to be getting my hair redone. As you can see, the roots are just terrible. Redone on, not this Monday, next Monday. But I'm having to travel all the way back to Manchester because. This is going to sound like I'm a really picky person, but I tried to find someone over here in Belfast and as you can see my hair is very, very blonde. Like I'm really conscious of just it being done perfect and someone, you know, not wrecking it. That's the finished look by the way guys. But yeah, um, yeah, wrecking it and then I tried someone over here and oh my god. I went and then she was trying this new thing she never really packed. I don't want to throw shade on her, like, I forgive her, like, it's nothing, it's out in the path, but she put a clay thing on my head and then didn't really patch, patch my, you no know, skin patch it to suggest it was alright for me. And then, not even joking, I was sat there waiting and she put, um, in the cling film over it to, like, heat it up and I was there, like, oh god, this is really hot, whew. And then all of a sudden I could feel sweat and I was like, and she was sat all the way over there on her phone just like waiting obviously for this to come off and I was like, oh god, I'm dying. And then I just looked briefly on my phone in the mirror just to see how bad I looked and I came up in white, white like, it looked like, it was like a yeast infection or something and then she finally came over I was like, yeah, it's really hot. And then we were talking about it and she was like, oh, do you want to like um, antihistamine? And then she sat down and took off straight away. And then my colour didn't even take. So it was literally like, no gain. <laughs> um, so yeah, it was a bad experience. And then she double bleached me and then we, we got there in the end. Double bleached me and hurt my scalp. <laughs> so I couldn't, it was very, very painful in this region of my head. Because I was just like, oh, the pictures I have on my phone are disgusting. Like. Like it was just bleeding, it was like wheezing out and it was just all over like little bits here and then the main one was there because obviously that's your crown, it's a really sensitive bit and it was just terrible, it was a really sad time and I was going to Amsterdam after, like a few days after that and it was just him in my head and obviously I suffered from migraines anyway and it just didn't help on top so that's why I'm going back to Manchester to my original angel of a hairdresser and she's going to sort me out so obviously my hair has been redone since then because that was february time but my mum did that and then that was a massive big blow up and it was it went yellow and but here we are now it's quite white so anyway well we're talking about hair anyway aren't we so goes with the video but um yeah that's why i'm going back to Manchester. i'm going to do a vlog so please you know I'm just gonna send them all looking at them. I'm like young boys. Oh, they have dogs just walking about the stairs. <laughs> yeah, so I'm gonna do a vlog, so please keep watching if you wanna see that. I'm gonna do like, I'm gonna get the ferry because it's just the safest way option right now. Like, I'm literally, it sounds so selfish because obviously my family's there, not all of them, but my friends are there, and it's like, I'm literally going and I'm getting coming back as soon as I can because I'm scared I'm gonna get stuck over there. But I'm going to do a vlog anyway, on the ferry, getting my hair done. I don't know if I'm going to do two separate ones or just shove it all together, but yes. Yeah. So there we have, anyway, the little 
would you call this a Dutch plait? I'll probably Google after if it's actually called a Dutch plait. But I think you can do whatever you want. I know I've got this stupid, pathetic thing hanging here, but I would probably just make it so it's all like slip back with a clip or something. Oh, I'll just shove this in for now. <laughs> and then, voila. And you can just keep taking it out if you do want it really baggy. And literally it just does whatever you want. Just keep doing that. Just be, don't be like pulling the wrong bits. Like I really, I want to pull all this out, but then I don't want to ruin the whole plait. Do you know what I mean? So I'm just going to leave it like that. So that is my finished look. But I look like a little Dutch girl. Don't know why I did that. I do like a little show around. Please ignore my clip at the side. So this is the finished look. video thank you so much for watching if you've made it this far and if you haven't already please don't forget to subscribe and I'm actually going to be doing a giveaway so when I reach 200 subscribers I am actually going to give something away like a little cute bundle of little bits and bobs like skincare makeup whatever whatever so yes please subscribe to be in a chance to win it all you need to do is subscribe to my channel take a screenshot if you just like subscribing to it and then post it to me if you can Watch, but you can't even do that, can you? Comment, subscribe. We'll work it out, okay? Just let me know somehow. And don't forget you have to follow my Instagram and my YouTube. So please follow me on Instagram. It's just at Beth and Hodgkins. And yes, I'll leave everything about the competition and the giveaway in the down there, the description box. And it's really funny because it's like out to play. I'm so easily amused. I'll leave all the details you need to know to enter the giveaway. And like I said, it will be going. When I reach, I will like end cut the competition at 200 subscribers and then randomly pick a name at random. Put you in a little house or something, you know. So yes, please don't forget to do that. Also, <laughs> keep adding max like PS, PPPS. But yes, I will, I will, oh my God, what is the word? I will announce the win winner on my YouTube on well, my YouTube video which I'll be posting for that time and then obviously on Instagram and I will private message the winner and yes so I hope you all good luck and see you all in the next video.